cash from the USDA? How, do, yeah. how does the USDA get in the they coyote have a big business? Facility in I thought Utah. they just killed them. They, no, they have a big facility in Utah where they're measuring their... They have them in long runs and stuff, and they're trying different kinds of barriers and things to see if they can design some kind of a system that's a coyote deterrent. While they're also breeding pairs in there, they have puppies. So uh, if you are licensed and what have you, and you got some connections, they'll sell you, you know, coyote puppies. You know, and that's where they got these two. When they got here, they were like nine weeks and seven weeks or something like that, I believe. They were pretty young. Twelve days? Did you yeah. find it over? Oh my. And they're US, it's USDA, not US Fish and Wildlife? It's DA. Oh. Oh, okay. I hope they're taking this yeah. on as a long time. Yeah. Fascinating. Okay. Right. She totally is focused on her. Nothing else in that. That is very cool. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not the one she's stalking well, either, so it's, nice. uh, yeah. yeah. I'm not the one she's stalking, yeah. so it is very cool. Hey. Hmm? Identified it, didn't want it. Come back for it later. Because you could face the target. <laughs> <laughs> this is like a timeout. She's resetting herself and then going back into ice dock. Why? Because it feels good. She's resetting herself. She's going uh -huh. back to that location where it's nice and cool and going right back into ice dock. I'll reset myself again. There's something over there. So even if you counter conditioned it, you'd have so much instinctive drift going on this. You betcha. That you'd have to work it constantly. You'd have to train a behavior. You know, for a while they were mugging people coming in the gate and we were training them to go to a corner and stay there. You know, and now a lot of times when you teach a station to, station behavior to an animal like that, they get it pretty quick and they'll go to the station. You can actually come in and throw the food yourself over there and they'll be and they'll catch it. Okay, these guys, you'd have to stay right on it with them because they'll go right back to the other one because it was more fun. I did it a little longer, you know, it was a better reinforcement.